Welcome everyone to AGDQ 2014. This marathon is uh, for the Prevent Cancer Foundation. Yeah, Prevent Cancer Foundation is a nonprofit in support of cancer prevention, research, education, advocacy, and outreach program nationwide, and play a pivotal role in developing a body of knowledge. Also run through Speed Demos Archive. <laughs> Speed Demos Archive is a premier community for video game speedruns and speedruns live. It's the best site to race video games online against others. Players of all skills are welcome to join, whether you'd like to be competitive or just race casually with friends. Mind of everyone, the, uh, the prizes for this run. The uh, look, the Chronicles of Mistara box set is going to be a twenty dollar buy in for that, and the Act Razor Two Perler is going to be five dollars to get input in for those prizes. Again, one more time, the limited edition, Japan only, um, Chronicles Over Mistara box set, uh, $20 buy-in. Um, uh, this game is your last chance to get it. It's an amazing prize. It comes with posters of all things, uh, posters, artwork, soundtrack, along with the physical copy of the game. It's really awesome. It's usually worth uh, $250 to $300, so now is your last chance to get it. I think it's a lot of And while the runners are getting ready, I'd like to read a uh, donation comment here. We have fifty dollars from Rebecca Loveheart. I'll check mine. My name is Golden, and I want to save the animals. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're a little behind in donations. Just kidding. Hi everyone, Vixie Nan from Two Achievements here. I'm happy that the charity is staying strong with huge amount of donations. It is important to take care of the cancerous disease before it affects the people we love and hold dearly. As far as all the many different speedrun blocks like Mega Man, Mario, and Zelda, it's wonderful to see Shadow Over Mistara making it into AGDQ. Yeah. Can't wait to see how quick this game can be broken. Murphagator! Any good um, arcade game, you 
I do button chat. Yep. yep. Okay. I'm going to apologize in advance that this is going to be really clicky because these, but, yeah. <laughs> but uh, the 360 pad is not conducive to playing this game. It, right. it really isn't. I'm a keyboard warrior by choice, but, you know, play with what you got. Can you help with it? Yes. <laughs> Continue with the comment here. <laughs> yeah. We have. Right, uh, yeah. I'll, I'll leave it to the professional. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. All right. And just one last reminder uh, after this game is Fire Emblems, this is your last chance for the bid war. I think uh, Sacred Stones is in the lead, so if you want Fire Emblem 7 in, you got to snipe it right now. <laughs> also, we want Mike Oyama to show some good co-op performance for the Wolf Team. Ow! <laughs> All right, um, we'll tell you when to start. And now. Yeah. All right, so what he's casting there is Bless, which um, increases the attack power for the whole party by, I think, uh, 25%. 25%. Yeah. yeah. And, then, and the reason why I'm holding off on attacking is that the Elf's attacks are actually really weak. But there is good reason uh, for the Elf to be in here. Yeah. So Which the magic user, they just gave a bunch of spells that hit the entire screen. It's pretty fantastic. It's, it's yeah. great. We, Ice we, Storm being the, the it's like, very fair. one. It, it does pretty good damage, but you know, these are just goblins, so it's no big deal. Uh, we have to rescue these people or else the game doesn't progress. Yeah. So if you ever find any like videos of this game, most of them just skip this part because you have to enter your name here yeah. and they don't want to time that so they can enter whatever name they want. Um, but your name is actually significant because it determines what, what starting you get. You get equipment you have. Yeah. For um, example, I'll, sh I'll show off my inventory. Yeah. I have the lightning rod because I entered yeah. exclamation point as my name. Yeah. <laughs> Butters and, and I, I have the earrings, um, which increase my attack power. And uh, Butters and I have the gauntlet strength, which increase our damage. So this is cloud kill, which is like the least well-designed thing to ever be put in a beat 'em up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, any normal enemy that is not undead will just be killed instantly by Cloud Kill. So here's yeah. three owl bears. Yeah. And so he's there making sure to wait um, a little bit there because he needs to make sure all three spawn. And one of your biggest enemies in this game is money and items on the ground because the attack button also picks up items. You can pick things up by sliding, but, but it's... But only uh, coins and little things. Right. Stuff that's not consumable. Right. So I'm about to use a spell that I'm really, really happy I get the chance to use called Stick to Snakes. Stick to Snakes! Stick to Snakes. <laughs> and yeah. this is cutscene chomp. Yeah, so... Uh, so Elf's Lightning Bolt is uh, funny. So it double hits some enemies, so I just took off about two-thirds of its life. So yeah, there's a yeah, boss. That was, yeah, a, boss. That was a boss. A uh, golf cart. <laughs> okay. Yep. And, yeah. Yep. Yeah, and the cutscene afterwards takes longer than the boss itself. <laughs> Easily. All right, so a big thing in this game is actually routing it. And for a lot of single player runs, you take the train route because it's shorter, but because money is such an issue in a multiplayer run because you can't uh, share your money normally, um, you take the river route because A, we have a bunch of magic casters to make up for Man Scorpion being a jerk. And you actually share the money that you get along this route and you get a lot of money, which we need throughout the run. So this is the best part of speedrunning challenge. Uh, yeah. oh, yeah. but, but how are you feeling? I'm feeling pretty good about myself, honestly. Good to be uh, at AGTQ 2014. Yeah. 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 It's a fun game. Yeah. No. Yeah. Good game. Helping out the Prevent Cancer Foundation, dedicated to uh, preventing cancer through research. Advocacy and outreach. And don't forget education. Yeah. Hey, oh, definitely. So now a mysterious voice is willing to tell us about some cool stuff, but we, we don't want to know anything. Yeah. We, oh, we and, and a heads yeah, up, yeah. we're actually holding down three buttons to speed up the screen it's, transitions. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's a thing. It's a thing. Yeah. And in the unpatched... Yeah. I'm trying to get off this raft. <laughs> I don't really like these people, but the raft is yeah. speeding up instead just to follow me, so it's, it's kind of annoying. So yeah. And what's convenient is that this actually automatically splits up the money, which never happens in any other stage. Okay. Don't touch me, don't touch me, thank you. <laughs> um, 
So, right, we have uh, Gauntlets of Strength, but they're very oh. fragile. Oh, oh, oh. 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 <laughs> So heavy. <laughs> the chest. Hopefully that doesn't get in the way of the slide. Right. Yeah. Oh, that's so hard. Yeah, okay. All, right, all, right. all right, we're fine. We're good, we're good. All right. Oh, I'll take that. Yes. That's good. So, yeah. Elf has a very powerful lightning bolt, but it's also very inconsistent. Uh, All magic uh, users green, is this strong, green, but... Dead, the bottle. Boosh. Oh, yeah. What? Oh, yeah. oh, we'll kill Green. Yeah, yeah. Green's not... Still not dead. Okay. okay. All right, green, green's dead. Oh, what's happening here? Uh, just hit him. Okay, just hit Get him. out of here. Oh, yeah. So, I have this move that insta-kills all oh. I'm dead. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah. Get the character. Yeah. Wow, he is giving us. Oh my yeah, in case you can't tell, this game gets really clustered when it's four people. Yeah, yeah. He yeah. blocks so. Oh my god, I feel bad. Uh, oh, right. This already right. is not going well. Yeah, well, Man Scorpion is where we knew bad. Yeah, so happen. Man Scorpion is a very random, inconsistent boss, as you can probably tell. Um, even though Scent died, we still had a pretty good fight because we killed him fast. And the way we actually need experience for this run, like experience <laughs> is your score in this run. And this game's really weird because you can defeat bosses in two, in four minute, two minute, and zero minute increments for a time bonus. Yeah, it just got the hammer. That would have been tragic. Like yeah, there's no the odd numbers when there's minutes. It's very strange. <laughs> 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 All right. So yeah, guys. this stage. Yeah, this, this is going to be fun. So remember our friend Cl Cloud Kill? Yeah. Yeah, enemies get Push. more life. And, and, and here's our friend but... Magic Missile. Yeah, and uh, the mage also has Magic Missile, but mine is worse, which is actually better, because it means the animation is shorter. Yeah, because I'll throw more missiles, which freezes time for longer. It gets refreshed. Right, uh, for bonus. Magic user, it's easy to tell, because... Um, it really varies. You oh, crap. Son of a... I hate you with every ounce of it's my okay. being. Yeah, this is one of the oh, worst so bosses checking. in the game. So we use ice storms to try to keep her in check. She's gonna be up like right after the strike. No, but... Uh, that'll work. Uh, I just had to... Uh, I yeah, 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 the yeah, fireballs right now. there. Right, that's I, good. That's, that's fine. That's fine. And, we're, and what Murph and I are trying She's to do, up. we're just trying to keep the... Uh, uh, Elves off of them, so um, the dwarf and the cleric can, com can combo. Because the dwarf and elf do a lot more damage than both uh, elf and ma magic users. No, she is not. She's up. Oh, oh and she's shoulder jacked. Oh, yeah. All right. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. She's hit her. You're feathered. She's dead. She's dead. That was actually a pretty decent fight. Um, she's a very inconsistent boss. Yeah. yeah. So some of the fun things she can do is she can just stand up instantly without going through her normal recovery animation and then just attack on the first frame that she's standing. And her attacks do just bolt loads of damage. Yeah. It's really dumb. Bye, skeletons. Bye, skeletons. Yes. <laughs> the old flavor. Mm. We have a $50 donation from Alistor. No. Plan to complete week. Oh, all right. Just keep going. All right, we'll, we'll do the full bar. Nice. nice. Okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. That's, that's a really. Hard, that's actually really hard to do, as easy as it looks, because you only have about two or three frames per swing, and they're both trying to hit at the same time. We have to yeah, hit on the same. And they use an audio cue to, yeah. to yeah. do yeah. that, yeah. so it's it's yeah. And um, so yeah, that that's not the only boss that works against, but um, it's just really effective against uh, Teleran, the boss that we just yeah. fought. Yeah, and especially at this point in the game with the and tools that we and have. It, and as you might have noticed, even though we took his health yeah. all the way down, you can't kill him. Yeah. Um, and to make it a little more awkward, uh, we don't attack at the same time. Uh, yeah. Butters attacks slightly faster than I do, so the timing is really, yeah. really tricky. So one of the reasons I have Elf in the party is for um, this route that's available to us coming up. Yeah, normally we wouldn't and be able to do this. it is an action-packed stage. It's exciting. Oh, you guys will love it. Yeah. In fact, we might need these audio cues called donation reading at this point. <laughs> Already. We have a $20 donation from Andres Snuras Nordstein. 
It says if you can pronounce my name correctly, I'll donate another $30. I, I did my best. Oh, sorry. Uh, just one thing I want to say about this area is that, yeah, invisibility, it does things. <laughs> and they don't really attack you because they can't see you. And there's too many enemies here to kill in time. And this stage is on a timer, so we just wait it out. Um, it will eventually wear out. Yeah, it just wore off right now. But um, we're, we're going to be able to progress to the boss quite soon. Uh, set you want to equip. Yeah, I have them. I, I do it right, uh, right as we slide. So yeah, there's a reason why I bought a bunch of hammers. So um, hammers will bounce off enemies and hit them multiple times. And that... The dragons don't like that very much. Double earrings. Double earrings. Yeah, double. Nice. Yeah. Got him. Got him. All right. I don't think I got one. Are there any four classes? Uh, there are uh, there six, classes. six. But these are the four that work yeah, out. We the don't best really need any items here. Yeah. 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 Okay. We're not um, using the thief or the fighter. Right. And also, um, the magic user cannot use hammers at all. That's yeah, why I yeah. wasn't contributing to that fight. <laughs> And actually, he died so fast that I couldn't switch my haste in time. So that's that's yeah, fine. We'll just block sliding. a little bit. Yeah. Because basically, whenever you're just um, doing movement stretches, you always want you, as a general rule, want to hate. unless you need the magic or something exactly. else. So okay, I'll explain how the magic works while you guys are fighting the witch. Yeah. Um, so the way magic works in this game is that spells get have lower, different levels. Get lower, please. Get lower. Okay. Yeah, but um, there you go. Uh, okay. okay. Well, let's just get him on the right here. Don't you, don't you, um, don't you, don't you. Uh, what? Get lower. Um, uh, okay, there we go. Whatever. So it were, this game actually follows the advanced D&D rules quite closely for a lot of things. And one of the things that it does follow pretty closely is the spell, the way spells work. So there's different like tiered uh, levels of spells. Uh, um, okay. uh, just slide over. There's different tiered levels of spells. It's actually very similar to how Final Fantasy I worked on the NES, now that I think about it, because yeah. you have like, yeah, exactly. So there's like level one spells, level two spells, level three spells, so on, so on. And um, for some spell levels, you have multiple, like for instance, the magic user has lightning and uh, fireball that are the same level. And for elf, haste and lightning is the okay. same level. Which is, position. Yes. Yeah. So yeah, we stand in specific spots to make sure that this yeah. walking to here is shorter. And they're player specific spots. Yeah, so, um, but anyway, like, for the elf, it's actually really important because haste and lightning are the same levels, and they're, uh, they're both very situational use spells, but he has a pretty limited number of casts for it. Also, you notice I'm casting the thing called Bless that I use on everyone, and then Striking that I use individually. Bless gives an attack boost, Striking gives even more of an attack boost, and it's Dax, which is really, oh, really dumb. really bad positioning here. Yeah. He's trying to go for flesh to stone, which kills any. That's pretty good. He kills anything. Anything. <laughs> anything much. that's not a boss. Yeah. It just dies. Another very well designed spell. Like all magic user spells. Oh, that's not true. There's several that are just bad. I just don't. Know <laughs> that's true. what you noticed because the fire from the trap was on screen. The goblins didn't throw rocks or their oils. Yeah. It went up. Oh, pretty oh, fantastic. He got down. Whatever. So yeah, you can OTG. Uh, Displacer Beast with some things. And, got and the magic um, user is more of a safety in his, this fight. Yeah. He's just trying to keep the goblins off us and cloud kill if Displacer Beast gets out of position. Yeah, this fight's actually pretty difficult without the magic user in the party because the whole... And elf special is very interesting in that if an enemy is large enough, it will actually help mul hit multiple times on the ground. He's not cooperating. There you go. Yeah, as you can see, we're doing a lot less damage now that uh, Bless and Ever Bless is striking a worn off. Just just hit it. Just hit it. That's still a pretty decent right. fight. Yeah. yeah. Remember, fighters, you have oh. the skin. I have the yeah. beast. I have this. Uh, no. Oh no! Yeah. Okay. Uh, did I get? Oh, no, 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 the skin. Oh. No. Not a big deal. No, no big deal. I got the eye of the displacer beast. Yeah. Okay. So the eye of the displacer beast mic. is supposed to um, don't, reveal secrets. Don't. Don't. Uh, <laughs> We're not saving the gnomes. The gnomes are dead to us. Yeah, so Screw you, dead. gnomes. So, large burning oil. They're a thing in this game. Oh yeah, my, well, you'll see in a while. Okay, so this is, we need to coordinate here. Yeah, so we'll, we'll tell you what the phase belt is. Yeah. Uh, 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 I didn't see it. Up. Yeah. Please be up, please be up, please be up, please be up. Thank you. It's not that bad <laughs> if we miss the first one. Up. 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 All right. We have a $50 donation from no. Gary Guy. No. No. 
No, he's okay. It's not that okay. Alright, Should more. I keep going? Yeah, you're okay. Yeah, you're okay. Okay. Yeah, now you're fine. He says, excited to see oh, some oh. side-scrolling AD&D action. That is a very balanced party you have. Also, <laughs> <laughs> go elf. My inventory was full. Oh, yeah, that happened. I picked up a short sword or yeah. something. Yeah, I picked up a short Okay, so speaking of our well balanced party, um, at, you've probably already seen what the mage's role is just kill every single normal enemy that exists. Uh, Dwarf is there for whacking things, uh, Cleric is there for the buffs, and he's also pretty good at doing juggles and whacking things, and I'm there more for support magic. So, yeah, well balanced DD party. Um, and the thing about the stage before this one, the reason why we're like yelling and being a little tense about it right. is because. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Got it. You have to be on the lookout for a very specific visual cue. The yeah. sign that breaks, depending on whether or not a piece like is left behind, determines which way you have to go. Yeah. And if we mess that stage up badly enough, we have to fight a boss that we have no way of fighting. We have no strat for him, so. Mm. Yeah, basically, if there's a piece on the ground, it'll be shaped in an arrow telling us what direction to go. Otherwise, we just follow the goblin. Also, we should talk a bit about, I'll talk a bit about my character, Cleric. Uh, Cleric is probably, like, the most top-tier character you can have in a team. Like, there's, there's no team that isn't better by having Cleric on it. Because he just, like, I just did this. Oh, wow, and he instantly got up. Of course. Okay. Yeah. Because, uh, for instance, he has a spell called Continual Light that freezes anything, including bosses. Yeah, so, LBOs are uh, really powerful. Get the lightning rod. Yeah, I would. Yeah. LBOs are just fantastic. They're, they're yeah. great. They're Best very item. well balanced. All right, this is and this is actually a dwarf yeah, exclusive perfect, route, yeah. and the reason why we're choosing this route is because it gets uh, We don't bosses. need anything anymore. We, ha we definitely have enough experience. Yeah, help if you want it, but... Uh, oh, we we'll already have enough experience, actually. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah we, we already we had, had really experience. good boss fights, except yeah. for Man Scorpion. Yeah. Which so, yeah. we don't usually get a time bonus of any sort. Crap, I'm, I'm going to be the reason we don't want to see. I'm really sad now. We've still got plenty of things yeah. that can happen. Exactly. <laughs> oh, Gullis. Gullis. Wow. Oh, that's really good luck. That's, that is great luck. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> so another great thing is that Mage can't actually push statues. Yeah. <laughs> Every other character can, but Mage is like, no, those are too Even heavy. the dainty Also house. can't, yeah. yeah. Also Absolutely. can't lift, uh, lift chests. Nice block. So yeah, this uh, stage is the Mage wipes everything. Um, this is this is actually a consequence of a dwarf route. If you didn't take the dwarf route, you would actually fight uh, the second Pelerin here. Yeah. And, and it's and just the, him by himself. Yeah, it wouldn't have been both of them. Exactly. Uh, Exactly, and it's slower if you take the dwarf out here because there's so many enemies. But with the magic user, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what, what it also enemies? works out. It also works out that another fight later gets. Uh, oh, yeah. get, yeah. get, sliding. Don't be so bloodthirsty, magic user. Uh, I know. I was very <laughs> angry with them. Quickly, shields up. Pretend to be useful. Protect the mage. Well, yeah, human wall. I'm very, I'm very yeah. vulnerable fortress, right now, guys. Fortress, <laughs> fortress. Oh my! But look at me. I'm so dainty. So yeah, very intense. But yeah, and magic user can like jump around and change directions in midair. It's pretty cool. I feel like we should talk about the other characters as to why we didn't pick them. Um, Fighter is really good, like late game, he gets a lot of cool items, but like early game, he doesn't his damage isn't really all that high, and dwarf is just good all the way through damage wise. Well, honestly, so. his late game items are you you have to get them by taking them away from the magic user's late game item. Or that stealing them. Or go way far out of Yeah, we'll yeah. go really far out of your way. Yeah. Um, the thief can steal things, and she actually has some really interesting combos, but she just doesn't have the damage. Right, let me heal you with the next screen. Yeah, she's easily the weakest character. Well, you'll have the, she's the chest fun, screen. but... Yeah. Cool. Oh, wow. Oh, it doesn't matter. Matter. It doesn't, yeah, we're final. All right, so... <laughs> get in the, the window! Bomb. I'm trying to get in the window. <laughs> We're still like damage, take some fire. And then there's a thief who I just love thief. She's like yeah, she's I don't know, a really fun she's, character. She's waifu tier and she's like really cool and fun, but she's just the worst character in the game. Like yeah. easily. She's, she's she she has a hard block, time. she has really weak attacks. Her damage doesn't scale properly because the oils don't yeah. get more damage like, as the game goes on. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, this is uh, Ezra Horn who is a horrible, horrible boss. And but fortunately lightning does lots and lots of damage to him. But he has lots of times when he 
can become invincible, so I have to be really careful about when I do this. And another thing about lightning that's really important is it gains damage as it's hit more enemies. So like hitting enemies and then like angling it to hit him does a lot more damage than just shooting him. Yeah, you don't want it to all hit simultaneously. You want it to hit I need you. I uh, just I'm upset out. dwarf. Right. Or wait, no, uh, I'm not. Yeah, I am. Uh, I, okay. <laughs> Mike, do you want to throw one? I can't yeah, throw, I can throw one. one. All right. Uh, I don't know if that'll hurt him. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Cool. That's going to do a lot on the second hit. Too, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to stand back, though. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> a little too far back there, buddy. Yeah. Hey, let me heal you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Are you getting a bless, sir? Uh, nah. Uh, not, he's, not yeah, really he's, well. he's going to die. too low for it to matter. Yeah, go clear it. All right. I earned that one. You earned that one. Average party contribution from the cleric. Yes. Uh, we are left here, I think. Uh, no, it's no, it fades. fades. Yeah, it's uh, fades. You'll notice that uh, the magic user's uh, staff is going to be glowing now. Yeah, this is nothing. You probably should have healed yourself, Dwarf, but whatever. I'll be fine. Uh, we need Actually, it doesn't money. even matter. We need yeah. the money. Yeah, we need the money. We need the money. If for, you should yeah. try and get the money on the, the screen that's after Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll get it. I'll uh, try and get on the I, same I, plane I can right actually now. pass it off. Yeah, you might notice I'm casting heal like during these transitions because it doesn't really waste time due to yeah, the enemies, the enemies so, yeah, certain animations just keep going during spells and the enemies in the background running is one of them so hellhounds are normally a super obnoxious enemy but fortunately they are not undead <laughs> wow <Wild kill. laughs> One of them decided, wow, they all died this time. Oh, they all died. Yeah. In practice, they, one of them was like just ignoring cloud kill. It was well, really cool. He'd fall down and take damage, but he wouldn't die. Yeah. Which, okay. Oh, okay. Well, that doesn't take damage. Yeah, reverse yeah. gravity gets really big. I love the flavor. The old the flavor. Yeah, as you might notice, this game has some interesting voice samples because it's Capcom back in their fighting game days, so yeah. As a note, Butter is, is just healing to heal. Like, it doesn't yeah. waste time, and we're actually going to lose all of our health in the next boss, so... Get back here. Uh, just let him stand you up. Just let him stand up. They're going to run away. Yeah. yeah, I know, but it doesn't matter here. That's why I was doing it. <laughs> yeah, still. Don't risk more Hellhound standing up. I'll block for you, Mike. Yeah. Or blocking with my face. So. Yes. <laughs> yeah, those last guys just are done fighting. Alright, yeah, I'm, I'm going home. I'm going home. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, it doesn't even matter if you scroll the screen there, by the way. Alright. We have a very difficult boss fight coming up now. Yeah, we're, we're probably going to need serious time for this boss. Yeah. No, no fake serious time. But, uh,. <laughs> This guy is. Uh, this guy is legitimately the most guy's, difficult. Yeah, boss usually in the last is a very game. serious death thing, but because the staff is glowing, we can just kind of. Yeah, that's just why we get the staff. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, final strike is. Hey, uh, he's he's dead. dead. Yeah. Oh, you should sign and get that. Uh, yeah, yeah, so yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get, get the money. money. I got it. Spike rules him. Oh wait, left. 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 Yeah. <laughs> yeah, nice. yeah, that will one hit kill every single boss except for the final one. And the red dragon, but there's no way you could have it. For yeah, the fight. final one who has an absurd amount of health and is just designed to be a total quarter muncher. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's Thanks. really stupid. Everyone got the potions? Yep. yep. All right. So normally we would fight this guy. He. But. He gets. Uh, yeah, but thankfully just, we say Teleron, so yeah. Yeah, he's just like whatever. It's He'll do it for us. He goes Akuma and then just dies. Yeah. yeah. All right, down we go. Yeah. All right. One, uh, I get this. two, uh, no, I'm not. Three. All right. Then I think you got it. Don't blink. Yep. Perfect. <laughs> As you said. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah. Uh, Toughest and... boss in the game. <laughs> Time. 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 All right. One, one more. Nice. nice. Oh. Nice. The oh! <laughs> okay, so that boss needs some explanation. So, um, even though Elf and Magic User both have the lightning spell, they both have yes. different properties. Um, against certain enemies, um, the Elf's lightning will actually um, double hit, and you can critical sin after the third hit. So basically, a continual light counts as a hit. So for some reason. Yeah, for some reason. So 
the cleric cast three continual lights, the fourth lightning is a critical hit and it hits twice, and that's how you kill Sin in a four player run. Yeah, yeah. and you can tell that you got it correct because she blinks when you hit her. Exactly. It works on both the dragon bosses actually, but yeah. it makes it really fun for single player because, like, for instance, in the magic user route, I have to do the three hits by myself. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, it's, it's even more fun in the Dwarf solo route yeah, because I can't use... cast lightning, so I have to pick up four lightning rings <laughs> yep. and then hit her in a way that I get two lightning crits. It's, it's fun. Yeah, it's... Yeah, I like how he's, he's immortal because I can't say God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the immortal's flavor. All right, All right so okay. one quick thing. Um, the ending kind of changes depending on how much money you end out with. Like, you get different texts. Oh yeah, I, I get to build my own tower this time. Oh, usually oh, I don't yeah. have enough money. Murph stole the money. Yeah, usually I just wander around. Or something. <laughs> and this time I get to build a tower. That's great. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. One thing we didn't even mention. Uh, you might notice that Murph is using the green magic user. Um, depending on if you if you push a regular button, you get kind of a default character. But if you push start, you get the alt character. Usually yeah, you'll this be is able like to see them here. Purely aesthetic, yeah. like Power Ranger fighter yeah. and yeah. alt cleric. Yeah. Usually this is aesthetic, but uh, for cleric and magic user, they actually like get slightly different spells. Cloud Kill is one of those yeah, spells. Yeah. Is one of those spells. Yeah. Normally you get Conjure Elemental, which is like a really terrible spell. The, the elf yeah. actually also gets Conjure, Conjure Elemental, Elemental, and we yeah. never use it. Yeah, and different elementals. <laughs> which, yeah. elves is extra special. Yeah, yeah. Elves, elves Conjure Elemental is like a level 6 or 7 spell, and it does like the least damage of any spell yeah, in the entire exactly. game. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so yeah, and another thing, you get... You know, they're gonna give us the score right now. You get an absurd amount of score for killing Sin. So 500,000 points for Sin. 500,000 <laughs> points. So even if Mike didn't kill any of the bosses, he is going to guarantee have a high score. Oh yeah, one more thing. Uh, the alt cleric doesn't have uh, Stick to Snakes, which automatically means I'm never gonna use him because Stick to Snakes is just fantastic. He gets a beetle swarm. By the way, um, if you're trying to get in your final bids for a Fire Emblem, um, once we turn this game off and show the Fire Emblem prize, that'll be the cutoff for the bid war. Oh, whoops. Nope. Oh, oh right, because you push something, it actually yeah. slows down. It slows yeah, it yeah, down. Yeah. You can't yeah. speed this up. Yeah, you can My controller is on your stick. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. Okay, and next up is either Sacred Stones or Fire Emblem 7. Whoa, I didn't oh, get a wow. little score. Go I'm, me. I'm sad. In, in our practice oh, my, run, I actually topped the off. scoreboard. Yeah, <laughs> that's just incredible. amazing. My All mic right. fell off, so I hope people heard me. <laughs> uh, yeah, mine, mine fell off somewhere around Pellerin. <laughs> We have a $50 donation from Anonymous. Hey guys, thanks for all the work you guys put towards a great event and a great cause. Been watching these for years, but finally have a little cash to throw in, so here you go. Keep having fun and show cancer it can't have its way. $20 donation from Paul Russell, Echoing Clock. Here's 20 towards Fire Emblem. $50 donation from Anonymous. I've been working from home a lot this week to watch AGDQ as much as possible. Phenomenal run so far. Best of luck to all the runners. $30 donation from TT. Good afternoon from the UK, runners. I lost my grandfather to cancer a while back and words cannot describe how devastating it was. No one should have to go through such an ordeal. What you guys are doing to raise money to fight cancer is awesome. There should be more like you. Keep on running. 